I would also request that there be an ankle monitor placed on Mr. Williams, as well as that have no internet access at all and no contact with any minors or animals. So her address doesn't become uh, common knowledge for, for her public, although she loves her public death. She wants some some uh, private, privacy occasionally as well. I, you know, look, I'm so used to getting beat up. I didn't know how Marjorie was feeling about everything. Diving into the high octane world of celebrity drama, we uncover the tumultuous and explosive relationship between Steve Harvey and Shirley Strawberry, a duo who've made headlines due to a web of controversies and conflicting ties. Their journey, rife with controversies and dynamism, provides a tantalizing look at the intricate world of celebrity conflicts. He cannot be around Shirley's daughter, who is said to be a victim of his, Shirley's grandchildren, who are said to be victims of his. When this came out, it's a little bit different because it's not gossip, rumor, or a malicious lie. It came from the inside circle. Hi, everyone, and welcome back to Celeb Live Channel. Steve Harvey and Shirley Strawberry are no strangers to the limelight, with Steve being a household name in comedy, television, and radio, and Shirley reigning as a notable radio personality. They've shared a working friendship that traces back to jovial exchanges and collaborative ventures, setting the airwaves ablaze with their dynamic chemistry. To request more and more payment, promising that those services and goods would be later provided, but never making good on those promises. However, this seemingly serene partnership faced its storm when Shirley's husband, Ernesto Williams, entered the picture, ushering in a phase of conflict and strain, both legally and personally. Ernesto's nefarious activities, spanning theft, fraud, and gun possession, catapulted him into the realms of legal turmoil, resulting in a 23-month sentence in 2022. This shadow of controversy extended its grasp to Steve and Shirley's camaraderie, painting it with strokes of public speculation and dismay. Essentially positioned themselves as experts in the fields of business growth, development, coaching, things of that nature. To thicken the plot, rumors swirled about Steve being the catalyst who introduced Ernesto to Shirley. Whether rooted in truth or fiction, this narrative fueled the fire, suggesting a faltering bond between Steve and Shirley, with Steve ostensibly playing the matchmaker in this contentious liaison. Shirley Strawberry was on a phone call with her husband in this conversation. And there were a couple of other comments that she made. Things reached a boiling point when a confidential conversation between Shirley and Ernesto surfaced online, exposing intimate details about Steve and Marjorie Harvey's life, including Shirley's discomfort around Marjorie and insinuations about Steve's passive acceptance of his wife's purportedly dismissive behavior. For me to bring this particular thing up, I, I was just so embarrassed, you know, and humiliated, and I, I just felt like a fool. This leak, unintended for public ears, became a catalyst for public debate and forced Shirley to publicly repent for her words, especially amidst the circulating rumors about Steve and Marjorie's relationship dynamics. Her public apology on the Steve Harvey Morning Show illustrated a palpable sense of regret and realization of the potential fallout from her uttered words. No, she's not there. If she was there, we probably wouldn't have been all over the house. <laughs> wouldn't have done it. No, you know he's scared. Steve's response to this turmoil was a tapestry of understanding and grace, attributing the scenario to unfortunate timing and maintaining Shirley's innocence of any ill intent. His passionate defense of his wife, Marjorie, denounced the baseless gossip, reaffirming his unwavering commitment to her. He portrayed Marjorie as his anchor, emphasizing her virtues and dismissing the unfounded criticisms directed at her. She's, oh, mm-mm, nope. <laughs> Damn, wow. She's, she looks at us as the help, you know? You did tell me that. That's not a good feeling. Yeah. The curtain lifts to reveal a world of whispers, leaked conversations, and tarnished reputations within the glamorous spheres of Steve Harvey and Shirley Strawberry. In a tale twisted with controversies and hidden discord, Shirley's clandestine conversation with her partner, Ernesto Williams, unveiled the fragile strands binding her to Steve Harvey. Let me say this to you, Shirley. We have known about this right after it happened, but we came. It was a slip, a candid conversation unintended for the prying ears of the public, where Shirley opened the clandestine doors to Steve and Marjorie Harvey's intimate life. Shirley, now the focal point of a heated controversy, spoke the words of remorse, her voice a mix of regret and embarrassment. I want to apologize to you and Marjorie for what I said. I can't take it back. However, Steve played the part of the gracious forgiver, emphasizing Shirley's lack of harmful intent. But beneath the surface of calm acknowledgement simmered a concealed annoyance, a silent battle against the impact of Shirley's revelations on his reputation. And, 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 and it made it look like Shirley was piling on. Mm -hmm. And that wasn't her intent. And who could blame Steve for his concealed frustration? 
his passionate portrayal of Marjorie as a symbol of moral high ground spoke volumes of his commitment to shielding her from the swirling storm of rumors. In a world brimming with whispers, he painted her as the embodiment of virtue, kindness, and unwavering loyalty. But insiders whisper about the strain, about the silent turmoil brewing within Steve, a hidden struggle with the realization of the shadows cast upon his reputation by Shirley's unintended revelations. These, these bottom feeders are just beating my wife when we said we're not going to dress it. I'm, I'm tired. In the echoing halls of celebrity whispers, insiders reveal the unseen tension between Steve Harvey and Shirley Strawberry, suggesting that both Steve and Marjorie Harvey are at the brink of their patience with Shirley's unrelenting cascade of controversies. She's become a liability, a constant stain on the gleaming facade of Steve's brand, whispers a concealed voice close to the Harvey household. With Steve painting himself as a relationship guru, each of Shirley's scandals chips away at his meticulously constructed image, reflecting shadows of discord on his relationship council. Steve's own escapades, like the whispers of Marjorie's clandestine interactions with his bodyguard, are no secrets in the realm of celebrity gossip. But it's Shirley's continuous, tumultuous whirlwinds, her unceasing allegiance to her criminal partner, Ernesto Williams, and the most recent leak of her confidential conversation that have started ringing alarm bells in Steve's empire. Uh, before the 13th, there's going to be about 15 plus more warrants coming his direction, serious felonies in there. Insiders murmur that Steve and Marjorie seem to be unanimous in their silent verdict. Shirley has crossed the lines one too many times. Her relentless troubles and unwavering support for Ernesto have become a constant source of embarrassment and have started to corrode the golden reputation of Steve's empire. The intricate threads of conflict trace back to Ernesto's legal tumults, painting Shirley's life with brushes of scandal and ignominy. His criminal escapades, ranging from fraudulent schemes to possession of inappropriate materials, have cast shadows of disrepute on Shirley, leaving onlookers in a state of baffled shock, particularly at her persistent defense of a man mired in morally reprehensible acts, acts that have reached the sanctity of her own home, touching those dear to her. These shadows have traversed beyond the limits of Shirley's existence, reaching the luminous aura of Steve Harvey's public image, the leaked conversation, laced with subtle hints and whispered speculations about Steve and Marjorie's life, has become a flaming arrow aimed at the heart of Steve's meticulously crafted image. Shirley's words meant for the shadows have brought forth whispers questioning the harmony of the Harvey residence. Whispers Steve fights to silence with passionate defenses and ardent proclamations of Marjorie's virtues. Yet, the storm is not just a battle of whispers and shadows. It's a war on the Empire's very foundations. Shirley's scandals, her alignment with darkness and her whispers of discord, have become the serrated edges tearing at the fabric of Steve's brand, threatening the integrity of his position as a symbol of relationship wisdom. A once respected co-host now stands as a symbol of contradictions, her life, a turbulent sea of scandals, impacting Steve's reputation as a beacon of relational and moral wisdom. Steve, in silent turmoil, appears to be donning his armor, preparing his defenses against the relentless onslaught on his reputation. He seems to be distancing himself from the whirlwind that is Shirley Strawberry building barriers to shield his empire from the relentless storms of her life. He stands in the eye of the storm, a silent guardian of his crafted image, wrestling with the shadows cast upon his reputation by the unintended yet damaging revelations of his co-host. As we conclude this exploration, we reflect on the tumultuous whirlwind of personal betrayals and professional discord between Steve Harvey and Shirley Strawberry that have dominated headlines. The ramifications of this are tangible, with project disruptions and lost sponsorships underlining the tangible repercussions of such discord. A source close to the duo remarked, the tension is palpable. Projects are hanging by a thread, and it's cost you more than just peace of mind. The spectrum of public opinion on this matter is vast, with fervent moral debates around Shirley's steadfast support for Ernesto, amidst heinous allegations and fraudulent conduct. The ethical conundrums of her unwavering allegiance to Ernesto, especially when he stands accused of causing unspeakable harm to innocents, including her own daughter, continue to baffle and elicit criticism and moral scrutiny. A longtime fan expressed on September 1, 2023, via Twitter, it's heartbreaking to see Shirley stand by someone capable of such atrocities. It forces us to question her moral compass, Tracing back to past occurrences provides a profound understanding of this tangled web, unveiling underlying underlying tensions that might have been brewing inconspicuously. The cascade of personal relationships, legal implications, and consequent invasions of privacy have constructed a complex narrative around Steve and Shirley. Returning to our core theme, we delve deeper into the intricate matrix of celebrity conflicts. Steve's fervent defense of Marjorie and his categorical denial of malicious rumors exemplify more than just a spouse's protectiveness. They expose the intricate, delicate nature of relationships within the limelight. Speculating on future unfoldings, one wonders if there is room for reconciliations or if the conflicts would escalate further, embedding more controversy into their lives. 
Could we anticipate collaborative endeavors to mend the professional fissures, or will the discord intensify, adding more layers to their already complex relationship? Ending with reflective musings on the complexities within the realm of public figures, this journey through the turbulent relations between Steve and Shirley leaves us contemplating the delicate balance between public perceptions and personal truths. We invite our audience to contribute their thoughts and insights on this multifaceted narrative, pondering the deeper moral and ethical quandaries illuminated by these events. Continuing our exploration into the intricate maze of celebrity interactions and public reception, the labyrinth becomes more convoluted as we delve into the multifaceted and fervent fan opinions emanating from the YouTube platform. Firstly, one comment subtly underscores the notion that Shirley's remarks about Steve and his wife were far from disparaging. One fan noted, Shirley didn't even say anything harsh about Steve or his wife. I've said way worse things about my bosses in private, especially to my other half. Secondly, another fan articulates a perspective emphasizing individuality and acceptance. The fan comments, it was the way she felt and she's entitled to that. She did not go on a tangent to news media. It was a conversation with someone she knew intimately. We have to learn to accept the fact that people have their own ways of thinking. And if we can't to keep going, now it's your turn to join the conversation. What do you think about the ongoing conflicts and the moral questions they raise? Do you think Shirley's actions and support for Ernesto can be morally justified or does it reflect a deeper unresolved complexity within her relationships? How do you perceive Steve's role and response in this tangled web of relationships and public opinions? Please share your thoughts, insights, and opinions in the comments below. See you in the next video.